A new American hero was born when Rutgers' very own Olympic gold medalist Carly Lloyd scored the winning goal against Brazil at this summer's Beijing Olympic Games. She started playing for the Rutgers women's soccer team in 2001 at the midfield position until her last game in 2004. In each of her four years at Rutgers, she was named first team All Big East Conference and was Big East Midfielder of the Year in 2004. Carly traveled back to her alma mater this past September where Rutgers held Carly Lloyd Night. There was a pregame ceremony honoring the alum for her recent success. The former Scarlet Knights number 10 jersey was framed and presented to her in front of a home crowd at Yersek Field on the Rutgers New Brunswick campus. She accepted the distinction and offered a few words of gratitude. The women's national team midfielder made her sixth trip to China this past summer, but this one was unlike any other. It, it was incredible. It was just incredible walking um, around and being at the village and just seeing, you know, so many athletes and so many people, um, you know, just there for the same reasons to try to get that gold medal um, and you know it was quite a quite an experience you know an experience that will be hard to kind of share with other people unless you're really there but it was really fun. Rutgers women's soccer has a lot to be proud of boasting nationally and internationally recognized talent but there is one more Olympic athlete who likes to call New Brunswick home. In her third season as assistant coach for the Rutgers women's soccer team, Karina LeBlanc has a resume bursting with soccer experience. This Canadian national team member appeared in three Women's World Cups and the ultimate contest, the 2008 Olympic Summer Games. This summer you had an amazing experience in Beijing. What was that like and what is something that you think you're going to take with you out of that experience? Uh, I think, well, being able to go to the Olympics this summer was a, a dream come true I, ever since I was four years old. I'd watch it on TV and I'd watch every different sport and you know it was one day I wanted to be there and I remember telling my mom that you know I'm going to play in the Olympics one day and she was just like okay well just keep dreaming and keep working hard and so it was a dream come true and I think leaving it there's so many different experiences I can take away from it from the different athletes that I met or the lessons that I learned and just how I grew as a player and as a person. Just walking away from it, it'll be an experience of a lifetime I'll never forget. You do have this motivation and you're taking all of it and you're putting it into this team as a coach mm -hmm. and you're kind of re-channeling it mm -hmm. into a coach rather than a player. Yeah. So why did you choose Rutgers? What really pulled you to come coach here and even on a collegiate level rather than a different level? Um, I think I f one thing I found out about myself was that making other people happy makes me happy and it's 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 whatever you're blessed with and I think I'm blessed with the talent of obviously playing soccer at a high level and how can I give back. I came up here uh, three years ago in the summer I'd met Glenn Crooks and he said well why don't you come up once you meet the people here and you see the kind of characters and visions that they have it's so similar to what I would want and what I would want to be in going through the college process myself and understanding it, it's just a perfect fit and it's so easy to be here because of the people and the environment around and you know being around positive people, people with the same goals and visions allow me to be happy every day. Karina helped the Rutgers women's soccer team crack the national rankings for the first time in 2008, appearing in the top drawer soccer poll at number 25. Her passion for the sport is guiding the Lady Knights into the national spotlight. Because she's one of the best players in the entire world, having her around every single day is just, you couldn't ask for anything more. Like there's no other coach that has that resume out there. It's just, it's the best. And all of us, even the field players, are just really, really, really lucky to have her around. Watching her this summer in the Olympics was just absolutely amazing because I mean, you just feel, you're just so happy for somebody like that. She works so hard and she's always there for all of us and I just think that it's great and you know, want the best for her because she deserves it. These exceptional athletes are using their talent to spread the word of Rutgers Athletics and its tradition of success. If you're interested in finding out more about Karina LeBlanc, you can always visit her personal website at KarinaLeBlanc.com. And as always, if you want to learn more about Rutgers Television Network, you can always visit rutv.ruckers.edu. For Sports Night, I'm Angelica Fatale.